Hi, now I'm going to solve a problem which is to sort an array of zeros, ones and twos in the ascending order. Uh, meaning this array only has three numbers, zeros, ones and twos. So when taken this as an example, out, your output array should look something like 0, 0, 1, 1 and 2, 2. So uh, this is the after this 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 should be our output but how how do you implement this in a program using a programming language so the first solution that comes to mind when when it is sorting and it is in ascending order is use any sorting algorithm like the best one is the quick sort but the quick sort quick sort takes uh, n log n uh, complexity time complexity but this is a good solution too but can we do this in a better way or in an efficient way yes we can do this in an efficient way and uh, in 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 a lesser time compared uh, to the quick sort uh, that is by using three pointers that is a starting pointer ending pointer and a mid pointer start end and a mid pointer so the starting pointer will keep track of zeros end will keep track of twos and one uh, i'm sorry this is end this is mid so the mid will oscillate between the starting and the end pointers uh, to sort uh, the numbers uh, so how we are implementing this um, solution using the indexes is this is the approach this is the program so basically your function will take array as the input and it will check ba the basic conditions whether it is empty or null uh, if it is true then it will return to back to the calling function but because we have a valid array uh, we we start to define what our indices are so uh, and we'll define a temporary variable and assign it to zero now uh, like I told you like mid is uh, oscillates between the starting and ending index but it can't go past end so uh, our looping condition is mid should be less than the end only then uh, till then you should um, do the swappings and you know uh, sort the array so first time I'll uh, when the condition is true when mid is less than n uh, I'll uh, check what is my mid element my mid element is 0 array of mid is 0 uh, when it is 0 because there are only three elements based on the three elements what are the operations we are going to do we have defined it so when it is a 0 I'll swap mid and the starting element and increase increment both the pointers but because right now it is already in the right position uh, even after swapping it would be the same only thing that changes is we are incrementing these pointers to the next element start is pointing here mid is also pointing here now when mid is and then after after this this will break and we'll again check the condition is mid less than end yes and we'll check if this is one when this is one we won't do anything we'll just change the mid increment the mid pointer to the next element only if it is zero and two we'll try to swap but otherwise if it is one we'll just keep it as is so now mid is pointing here now mid is two when mid is two i'll try to swap mid and the end uh, 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 elements so now even after swapping it will be, our array will be 0 1 2 0 1 2 but after swapping we know def, definite for definitely that your last element is 2 because because it was 2 we try to swap mid and end right so after swapping your end index should be decremented and pointed to the previous element and your mid still stays at the same uh, position and your start stays at the same position so now mid is still less than end so i'll go ahead and check what is mid now mid again is two so when it is two again i'll swap mid and end so our new end is this so our new array will be zero one 
the 1 comes here 0 and 2 comes here 2 and 2 when a swapping happens e is incremented end pointer and your starting point is still here i mean mid is still here and your uh, starting is still here so now a uh, mid will check what is a of mid is less than end pointer now the one uh, mid is a uh, array of mid is one when it is one it will just increment the mid pointer so my new mid pointer is at zero now so uh, when when after incrementing it it will again check whether m is less than or equal to end so this this is true and mid is zero when it is zero we have to swap uh, start and the mid pointers right so elements in those uh, indexes so our new array would be 0 0 is swapped with 1 so your new array is 0 1 1 2 and 2 your mid is po your end is pointing uh, here mid is also pointing here but your start is pointing here now and i'm sorry after swapping i'll increment the mid so my mid is pointing to my my my, my mid is pointing here so when i check the condition mid is no longer less than or equal to this end so i'll come out of the loop by the time i come out of the loop my array has the sort my array is sorted according to the ascending order and that array i am returning back to the calling function so this is how in place we do sort uh, this particular problem of uh, zeros ones and twos in the ascending order um, like i discussed earlier um, sorting algorithm takes n log n but because we used an in place sort uh, by swapping the numbers so that uh, and we are traversing the array only once so this is o of n the complexity is o of n and we are not using any extra space so, so the space complexity is constant so this is my approach um, to to this problem thank you